Hey, I'm Steve. And I'm Matt. And we, we are, are not mechanics. mechanics. Hey, Matt. What are we doing today? Well, we're doing a lot of stuff, but we're going we're, to take a. Uh, we're going to pull out the master cylinder. Uh huh. Oh, it looks like we've done that. Slave cylinder. Oh. Yeah. Uh huh. Done all that. Okay. And put in the new one, which uh -huh. is actually pretty much in. We just have to tighten up the bolts on it. Uh huh. But I'm sure people are probably wondering how this thing works. All right. So this came off of the not the rod. The rod's brand new. This little doohickey here came off of the master cylinder up underneath where your clutch is. So if you're inside your vehicle, your clutch is right here. This attaches to the clutch. So when you push the clutch lever down, you push it down, it goes like that. Ah. And where does the other end of that go? Where does the other end of that From, go? From inside the truck. Yeah. This is going to push into the master cylinder. Yeah. I can't push it very well no, right it's all, now. It's all good. The hydraulic fluid is going to go through here. Yeah. To your, what's this called? C coffee cup. No. Oh, no, here. Slave. 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 Okay. So there's my slave. Yeah. And the slave, slave has a piston rod. I don't know what the exact name of it is coming out of it. We'll just call it a rod. So this sits inside your uh -huh. bell housing, well, outside the bell housing, uh -huh. inside the bell housing, uh -huh. up against your clutch fork. Uh -huh. And it'll be like this on this side right here. Uh-huh. Not the other side. Don't get it messed up. Uh, yeah, that's true. This side just sits nice and gently on a ball. A ball. And then it's got a little clippy clip too. When this push, it's got a clippy clip. Uh huh. And then this pushes it out. Uh huh. And when you push in the clutch, right? When you push in the clutch, uh -huh. it pushes this out. Pushes up against the um, pressure plate. The pressure plate. All right. So that that throw out bearing does what? Pushes. Should push up just like that. Yeah. So it's going to release these, it's going to push these springs down. Yeah. yeah. And on the opposite side of these springs, yeah. right here, yeah. it's going to, there's the other end of the springs, they're going to go like this. Yeah. So if you see my hand, right. it's like this, it yeah. goes like that. Yeah. And what that there, does, it causes them to invert. Definitely inverts them. Inverts them. So that they're not making contact with this. Uh-huh. What's that called? This is called a what? Uh, <laughs> I wasn't expecting. I know it's clutch it's plate. Clutch isn't it? plate. Yeah. <laughs> so uh -huh. When you release your clutch back out, uh -huh. these come back out to normal. Yeah. And what happens to that guy? And pressure gets applied to this. Uh huh. And it's attached to the flywheel. Uh huh. And then it starts to turn. Like ah. That. And I well, can do that because this brings a whole piece of it. Yeah. And it's not on the flywheel. No. I'm not turning a flywheel for demonstration. No, he's not turning the flywheel. That is too dang heavy, too much work. And what do the springs do? Oh, I think it just uh, dampens uh, the uh, torque. When you're tor torquing it, it dampens it so it doesn't just jam in. Otherwise, without them, it would just grab it, hold and jerk the would, truck around. Yep. It's good. So that's how your clutch system works. So uh, so if you've got what? If, <laughs> if, your, if your pedal goes all the way down to the floor, then uh, what's the diagnosis there? Your I'm clutch guessing, pedal, that is. Your clutch pedal goes all the way to the floor. I'm guessing you're going to have air in the line. Possibly mm -hmm. you're leaking. Mm -hmm. um, either way, you're not getting that, that force that needs to be able to applied to all the pistons in there. So that's my guess. Logic, I don't know. All right, folks. What, what do you think it is? Dude. Am I wrong? Am I right? I, I'm not a I mechanic. Mean, mechanic. Most of this stuff's not hard to understand. No. All right, folks. That's how your clutch system works. And now we're going to get to the getting. Uh we're getting back. We're going to get back to the real thing and mm -hmm. uh, and put this crap in. Mm -hmm. Do it.